Let's travel around the world together. Don't be afraid to visit somewhere new. How many continents and oceans are there? There are seven continents and five oceans. Asia, Antarctica, Africa, Europe, Oceania, North and South America, Pacific, Indian, Atlantic, Southern, and the Arctic Oceans. Let's travel around the world. English? Where? Hello, everyone. This is Jane from Jane's Stay English. We are going to learn about several different countries within the five oceans and seven continents of the world. Today, we are going to learn about Egypt. Would you like to follow me on this journey? Come on, follow me. English? Where? Egypt. Pyramids. Tombs of pharaohs. Egypt. Pyramids. Tombs of pharaohs. Egypt. Sphinx. Symbolizes the sun god. Egypt. Sphinx. Symbolizes the sun god. Egypt. Mummies. Preserving the bodies. Egypt. Mummies. Preserving the bodies. Egypt. Cleopatra. Beautiful and charismatic. Egypt. Cleopatra. Beautiful and charismatic. Egypt. Climate. Extremely dry and hot. Egypt. Climate. Extremely dry and hot. Pyramids. Tombs of Pharaoh's Sphinx. The Sun. God. Mummies. Preserving bodies. Cleopatra. Charismatic. Pyramids. Tombs of Pharaoh's Sphinx. The Sun. God. Mummies. Preserving bodies. Cleopatra. Charismatic. Pyramids. Sphinx. Mummies. Cleopatra. Pyramids. Sphinx. Mummies. Cleopatra. Pyramids. Sphinx. Mummies. Cleopatra. Pyramids. Sphinx. Mummies. Cleopatra. Spanglish? Where? EGYPT Egypt. History of 30 centuries. Oldest country in the world. Egypt is the land of legends. Talk about the pyramids. Were built as tombs for pharaohs. 130 pyramids have been discovered in Egypt. Cairo is the capital of Egypt. Cairo. EGYPT Egypt. History of 30 centuries. Oldest country in the world. Egypt is the land of legends. Have you heard of the Great Sphinx? Famous sculpture in Egypt. Lion's body, human head, symbolizes powerful sun god. Cairo is the capital of Egypt. Cairo. EGYPT Egypt, history of 30 centuries, oldest country in the world. Egypt is the land of legends. Egyptians believed in the afterlife, so they preserved their bodies as mummies, wrapped in layers of bandages. Cairo is the capital of Egypt. Cairo. EGYPT Egypt, history of 30 centuries, oldest country in the world. Egypt is the land of legends, everyone knows Cleopatra. Last true pharaoh of Egypt, born a princess of Egypt, beautiful and charismatic. Cairo is the capital of Egypt. PT Egypt, history of 30 centuries, oldest country in the world. Egypt is the land 
of legends The land is mostly desert Extremely dry and very hot Egyptians ride camels the most Camels are the ships of the desert Cairo is the capital of Egypt Cairo Spanglish? Where? Let's learn about the pyramids in Egypt. Over 4,000 years ago, pyramids were built as tombs for the royals and the pharaohs for religious purposes. They symbolized the wealth and power of the pharaoh. Pyramids were built using huge blocks of stone stacked in rectangular shaped layers each smaller than the one underneath it until the four sides of the rectangles meet at a point. The largest pyramid built was for King Khufu and is 471 feet tall. It took about 20 years for over 100,000 workers to build this pyramid and about 2.3 million blocks of stone were used. How the workers moved the stone blocks up the pyramid is a mystery that is yet to be solved. The Great Pyramid of Giza is one of the seven wonders of the ancient world. Let's learn about the Egyptian Sphinx. The Sphinx is known as a mythological creature that gives out riddles to travelers but kills them if the riddles are unsolved. The Egyptian Sphinx is a giant statue that has a head of a pharaoh and a body of a lion. It was built to protect important areas such as temples and tombs of the pharaohs. Numerous Sphinx statues were built in ancient Egyptian times, but the most famous one is the one that guards the tomb of Giza. Known as the Great Sphinx of Giza, the Great Sphinx is 66 feet tall and is the largest freestanding sculpture still standing from the ancient times. The original Great Sphinx looked a lot different. When it was first built around 2500 BCE, it had a long braided beard and a nose. Moreover, it was painted in vibrant colors. Today, the nose is notably missing, but no one really knows what happened. Some believed that Napoleon's troops knocked the nose off. However, the theory was proven untrue. Let's learn about the mummy. A mummy is a carcass of a human or an animal that is naturally preserved after the internal organs were replaced with natron and resins. Afterwards, the carcass is wrapped in bandages. In the past, many ancient Egyptians believed in the afterlife and resurrection. Thus, it was important for them to mummify their bodies so the bodies could be transported into the spiritual afterlife. The practice of mummification continued and developed for over 2,000 years. The pharaohs of Egypt and the members of nobility were usually mummified and placed in extravagant tombs. Let's learn about Cleopatra, the queen of Egypt. Cleopatra, the Egyptian queen, is one of the most prominent figures in ancient history. She was an intellectual pharaoh who protected her country and actively influenced Roman politics. She was able to solve international problems through diplomacy since she was fluent in a dozen languages. Moreover, she was clever enough to woo her allies and emphasize her godly status with her beauty. She protected her crown and maintained Egypt's independence for years. Despite her accomplishments, Many people still believe that Cleopatra's largest asset was her beauty. Let's learn about Egypt's deserts. Have you ever heard of the Sahara Desert? The Sahara Desert is the largest desert in the world 
and is located in North Africa. The desert spreads through 11 different countries, and Egypt is one of them. The Western Desert, a part of the Sahara Desert, the Eastern Desert, Great Sand Sea, Sinai Desert, White Desert, and the Black Desert are some of the famous deserts in Egypt. Let's learn about Cairo, the capital of Egypt. Cairo, the capital of Egypt, is the most powerful and one of the oldest Islamic cities in the world. Cairo has been the cultural center of the Arab world for a long period of time. It is an ancient city located on the banks of the Nile River. Thus, it has been an important trading center for thousands of years. Cairo is home to many famous Egyptian landmarks. The Egyptian Museum, the oldest archaeological museum where the world's most magnificent ancient masterpieces are displayed, is located in Cairo. Moreover, the pyramids and the Great Sphinx are only 8 miles away from Cairo. Despite the hot desert climate, many people live in Cairo along the Nile River. As of 2021, there are over 104 million people living in Cairo. Spanglish? Where? Egypt is the land of 
loves ledges. The land is mostly desert, extremely dry and very hot. Egyptians fry camels the most. Camels are the ships of the desert. Cairo is the capital of Egypt. Cairo. Egypt. Pyramids. Tombs of pharaohs. Egypt. Pyramids. Tombs of pharaohs. Egypt. Sphinx. Symbolizes the sun god. Egypt. Sphinx. Symbolizes the sun god. Egypt. Mummies. Preserving the bodies. Egypt. Mummies. Preserving the bodies. Egypt. Cleopatra. Beautiful and charismatic. Egypt. Cleopatra. Beautiful and charismatic. Egypt. Climate. Extremely dry and hot. Egypt. Climate. Extremely dry and hot. Pyramids. Tombs of pharaohs. Sphinx. The sun. God. Mummies. Preserving bodies. Cleopatra. Charismatic. Pyramids. Tombs of pharaohs. Sphinx. The sun. God. Mummies. Preserving bodies. Cleopatra. Charismatic. Pyramids. Sphinx. Mummies. Cleopatra. Pyramids. Sphinx. Mummies. Cleopatra. Pyramids. Sphinx, mummies, Cleopatra, pyramids, Sphinx, mummies, Cleopatra. Egypt, pyramids, tombs of pharaohs. Egypt, pyramids, tombs of pharaohs. Egypt, Sphinx, symbolizes the sun god. Egypt, Sphinx. Symbolizes the sun god. Egypt. Mummies. Preserving the bodies. Egypt. Mummies. Preserving the bodies. Egypt. Cleopatra. Beautiful and charismatic. Egypt. Cleopatra. Beautiful and charismatic. Egypt. Climate. Extremely dry and hot. Egypt. Climate. Extremely dry and hot. Pyramids. Tombs of pharaohs, sphinx, the sun, god, mummies, preserving bodies, Cleopatra, charismatic, pyramids, tombs of pharaohs, sphinx, the sun, god, mummies, preserving bodies, Cleopatra, charismatic, pyramids, sphinx, mummies, Cleopatra, pyramids, sphinx, mummies, Cleopatra, pyramids, sphinx, mummies, Cleopatra, pyramids, Sphinx, Mummies, Cleopatra. Spanglish, where? Welcome back. How was our journey to Egypt? Did you have fun? Which country should we visit next? Which country should we learn about next? Open your maps and stay tuned for our next journey. Bye, see you soon. Spanglish, where? How many continents and oceans are there? There are seven continents and five oceans. Asia is the largest continent in the world. Pacific Ocean is the largest ocean. Asia, Antarctica, Africa, Europe, Oceania, North and South America, Pacific, Indian, Arctic, Southern, and the Arctic Oceans. Let's travel around the world. How many continents and oceans are there? There are seven continents and five oceans. Antarctica is the coldest continent. The Southern Ocean borders Antarctica. Africa, Europe, Oceania, North and South America, Pacific, Indian, Atlantic, Southern, and the Arctic Oceans. Let's travel around the world. How many continents and oceans?
oceans are there? There are seven continents and five oceans. Africa is the warmest continent. Indian Ocean is the warmest ocean. Asia, Antarctica, Africa, Europe, Oceania, North and South America, Pacific, Indian, Atlantic, Southern, and the Arctic Oceans. Let's travel around the world. How many continents and oceans are there? There are seven continents and five oceans. Europe is considered the wealthiest continent. Atlantic Ocean is the saltiest ocean. Asia, Antarctica, Africa, Europe, Oceania, North and South America, Pacific, Indian, Atlantic, Southern, and the Arctic Oceans. Let's travel around the world. How many continents and oceans are there? There are seven continents and five oceans. Oceania is the smallest continent. The Arctic Ocean is the smallest ocean. Asia, Antarctica, Africa, Europe, Oceania, North and South America, Pacific, Indian, Atlantic, Southern, and the Arctic Oceans. Let's travel around the world. How many continents and oceans are there? There are seven continents and five oceans. North America has all climatic types. South America has the largest forest. Asia, Antarctica, Africa, Europe, Oceania, North and South America, Pacific, Indian, Atlantic, Southern, and the Arctic Oceans. Let's travel around.